Okay, so, um, yeah, I installed this X pipe. It, um, this is the O2 sensor. Come to find out that the European version of, um, of this vehicle did not have an O2 sensor. So it's my understanding basically it has a um, predetermined map for the air fuel mixture. And then um, it works with the mass air flow MAF um, that adjustment and somehow it magically understands um, what the uh, right air fuel mixture is. So what I decided to do was install an O2 sensor and measure the air fuel ratio um, and then um, and then install a meter inside the vehicle. So that's what I'm doing. And I went through a couple different uh, meters. Uh, I bought it through Amazon. And the latest one that I got, <clears throat> I only went through two of them, but the latest one I got was um, one that measured in Lambda. Originally I was doing um, whatever parts per, um, fuel parts per air. And it wasn't giving me um, an accurate enough reading. So I went with one that reads out in Lambda. Okay, so what I'm in the process of doing is I'm going to feed this line into the passenger wheel well. And if you can see inside there, that's the plug right in there. That's the plug uh, of the port that it goes through. And that's basically factory. I pulled it off when I was doing the X mount and um, it had red paint on the inside and it had that whatever, this stuff on the outside. So it's never been removed. The previous owner actually did install an O2 sensor. This is the hole that they punched through right here. So I need to plug it somehow, which uh, I'll do um, towards the end of all this. And the line that went inside just got snipped. I don't know what they were doing, whether it got connected to anything. Cause I don't think the, the ECU of the brains of this vehicle, the LH, whatever. Um, I don't think it has a a port or it doesn't read the O2 sensor. There's nothing to plug it into. At least I can't find it. So basically I'm gonna read it and then go from there. Okay, so we're gonna see if I installed everything. Basically, I brought everything into the floor panel of the passenger side, wired it all up, and then it's going through that little cubby um, area. And then currently right now, I just have it resting on that. Um, I just wanna make sure everything works. And then I'll go ahead and probably insert it deep inside that, that whatever mat pocket and so that I can see it as I'm driving. All right, so hopefully it'll start. It takes about 30 seconds for it to, uh, to go through its like warm-up procedure. So hopefully, that, so it's right at one. It's in Lambda units.